welcome back folks in today's demo I'm going to show you how to connect to a network file share and then you're going to install packet tracer so in order to start out there's many ways and there may be a shortcut on your desktop to the file share Okay. If there isn't one, this is the sure proven way to get there. Okay. On your taskbar down here, you'll see the little folder here. Well, this is the okay, file explorer. You click on that and open it up. Then you're going to click on in here. Okay. Get rid of all of that. And then you're going to do backslash, backslash. And then you're going to type in. S D U D E N T F S student file service, what it really is, okay? In the backslash, and then you're going to type in S T U, and you can see here, kind of shows up what that share is. So you can continue to type it out, make sure you put a space in there, but once it fills out, you're good. So student share, you know, all you do is hit the enter key. Once you have the file showing up or the shares or the files that are in that chair you select the one you want in this case there's only one file in there which is the packet tracer so you double click give it a second okay let me look and select all the defaults I'm gonna accept the agreement click next default location of where it's going to be installed at click next click next create desktop icon and if you want to create quick launch icon you can it doesn't matter click next and then you're going to select install Now the installation is done. Read a little message about the skills of version of packet tracers. Please close all browsers and restart your computer. So we don't have to worry about that. Okay. And here when you get done, you can hit checkbox to launch it automatically. And click finish when you, and that will happen. Or I typically uncheck it because I'm not going to run it right away. Click finish. Then you're done. So you can, all, you can go ahead and close that. Okay. Also, if you want. So you, because we're going to use the student share, you can click in here and drag it and drop it to your desktop. So now in the future, whenever you need it, need to go back to that, you don't have to go through that typing process. You just click on the folder, you just drag to your desktop. Simple. So now we are going to open up Packet Tracer. Double click on the icon that you put on the desktop. Click OK. Okay, don't worry about that message. You get a message because it, we're not doing too much. Okay, just click through them. And voila, there's Packet Tracer. Okay, we have another video on what we're going to do in our labs to, to uh, work with this okay thank you and i hope this will help you any questions you know where you can find have a good day